Hey guys, it's Trish. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing the Christian Dior Le Balm. This is a 3-in-1 cream. If you guys are new to my channel, subscribe and follow me on Instagram. So like I said, I will be reviewing the Le Balm. This is brand new, just came out, and I'm really, really digging the packaging. So today, I'll show you guys the packaging, the balm itself what i think about it i'll be testing it for a week and i will let you guys know what i think of it if i recommend purchasing it or not or maybe you just want to purchase it as a collection because the moisturizer itself is really really nice so i'll try it for a week and i'm going to use it mainly in the morning and at night time before i go to bed and see if my hands are smoother so i mainly use it on my hand and my elbows see if there's any difference and i'll let you guys know what i think so first off this le balm is 60 dollars usd you can purchase it on the dior website or from bergdorf goodman from my essay juan he is from new york i'll link his instagram down below so first off let me show you guys the packaging so this is the box packaging of christian dior le balm it is 50 milliliters for 60 dollars and it's very beautiful. We have the Dior Oblique here. On top it says CD. On the bottom it says 50 mil. And then here is the barcode scan for purchasing. This is the side. And then this is the back. So the balm, which is La Balm, it's for your hands, lips, and body. And then here are the ingredients. And it says this balm is for revitalizing balm for hands, lips, and body. And yeah, it's all in different kind of languages. You can also scan this code to this QR code to learn more about the product. So here is the Le Balm itself. I love it because it's super compact and very cute. If you guys saw my unboxing video, you guys will know that this Le Balm actually came in a different packaging. It used to be in a tube form and it wasn't doing too well. Like not too many people were talking about it, not too many sales. So what Dior did was they changed the packaging. It's more compact, more like you know, like a hand cream, you could put it into your handbag. And also they had a lot of ambassadors like Jisoo, you know, promote it, do advertisements for this product. So now it's super popular and I, it's definitely very true. Um, Dior did a great job on this product because I honestly, for me, I was not very interested in the other packaging or the product, but now that they changed the packaging and that Jisoo promoted it, I love it so much because I love Jisoo. So yeah, this is the hand cream, or I call it hand cream, but it's Le Balm for your hands, body, and lips. But this is what it looks like. It says Christian Dior is kind of like, you know, like the book totes or like your D-Way huge slides or the regular slides or like the Lady Dior's delight and yeah it has oblique on here and then in the back it tells you about the balm hands lips and body and yeah i'm very very excited to use it so this is my left hand next to the window show you guys it in the better light and then we will do a before and after and i'll let you guys know how it feels as well this is day one of trying the balm squeeze some out oh <laughs> Ooh, nice consistency all right so it's very smooth already and it's quite thick let me see how it smells it doesn't really have much of a smell it's like a light floral i would have to say let's do both of my hands i should have did a little bit less because a little bit goes a long way for this balm and this is how my hand is looking I'll show you guys the whole week reveal. So I just put a little dot on my hand and yesterday I put a little bit too much when I was squeezing it out but now this is the perfect amount so let me spread it around on both of my hands. So I spread the balm around my hand and my hand is more glowy and more moisturizing now. It is only day two but I will let you guys know my full opinions and what I think about it and it is definitely more woody the more you kind of moisturize it and spread it around but it's not too overwhelming. 
but that is going to be day two. Hey guys, it is day three of using lip balm and I'm really liking it a lot. My skin, I feel like it's way smoother now and I can't wait to see the result in one week. So let me go ahead and spread this around my hand. So what I really love about it is it's really spreadable. It's not too thick, it's not too thin. It's like the perfect consistency. And yeah, so it's very beautiful and quite shiny on my hands as well. So that is going to be for day number three. Alright guys, it is day four of trying a lip balm and I just put a little like, a little dot I guess you could say, it's kind of puffed up. Let me spread it on my hand. So I spread it on my hand a little bit to show you guys the consistency and I just love how like creamy it is. It's very light but very creamy and it's super moisturizing. It's only day four but I'm really really loving it already. So what I noticed from using lip balm so once you finish spreading it around your hands or wherever you put it at leave it on there for a minute and then it feels super smooth like there's no like sticky residue which i really like because when i use lotion i don't really like when there's too many like oils and like a residue on there so it's very smooth and i really like it a lot and it really does you know make my hand more shiny and like it looks more bright and more moisturized it is day 5, now let me go ahead and spread Le Balm around my hand. I love that it instantly makes my hand really moisturized and it looks much brighter and it doesn't look as dry as before because I just woke up and I brushed my teeth, that's why my hand was a little bit drier since I was using more hot water. But it definitely helps keep the moisture and it's really beautiful, I like this lotion a lot. It is day 6 of trying Dior Lip Balm and my hand really feels more moistured and I do wash my hands a lot so this has really been helping and I can't wait for the last day and then I'll show you guys the results but I'm really really loving it and I love that it's super compact and it can fit into your handbag. So after using Dior Lip Balm for a week, I actually really really like it a lot. First off, I will have to say I really love the packaging of it. It's really thin and very sleek and it's a very simple design but it's so beautiful. And I love that it's small enough to fit into my mini handbags. And it's really easy to open and close the cap. It's very beautiful. And I really love that it is multi-use so you can use it for your hands, your lips, and your body. And I mainly have been using it for my hands because I wash my hands a lot, but my hands feel so moisturized. I did forget to film day number 7, but I will have to say I've been using it in the morning and night and I love it so much. The formula of Dior Le Balm is infused with extract of Centella Asiatica, known for its soothing properties and selected to restore the skin barrier, as well as hyaluronic acid with hydrating properties and shea butter which is known to be nourishing so there's a lot of really great ingredients in here and it is $60 it is pretty pricey for 1.7 ounce but I think it's really worth it and a little bit goes a long way just need like a little like dot I would have to say and it's really nice I love it it's really creamy moisturizing and yes I will have to say it is worth it I do recommend purchasing it if you guys haven't already and I love that it has the like the oblique on there I love it so much Hopefully this video was helpful for you guys. If you guys have any questions, just leave it down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!